This is Gene Key, SkyServe News. Bastrop County officials concerned about higher temperatures and winds in the next few days have pushed back the time when some residents will be allowed to return to their homes. Residents of the Tahitian Village East and Cola Vista neighborhoods will not be allowed to return to the areas until around 10 a.m. Thursday at the earliest. Sheriff Terry Pickering said at a news conference those residents had been told that they could re-enter the neighborhood neighborhoods on Wednesday. I understand that this is frustrating for a lot of folks. Pickering said, adding that he's worried about fires getting worse over the next few days. Bastrop County's website has many resources for evacuees, including list of damaged structures, re-entry information, and fact sheets. The largest fire in Bastrop County was about 70% contained this morning, officials said. Fires have burned about 34,000 acres, or about 25% of Bastrop County, said Mike Fisher, the county's emergency coordinator. A cause of the largest fire is still being investigated. A man accused in multiple Texas rapes will be shackled during his trial. A Texas man accused of raping several elderly women will be handcuffed and wearing leg irons during his trial. Prosecutors allege Billy Joe Harris is the so-called twilight rapist. The Missouri City man is charged with aggravated sexual assault of a disabled person. His attorney plans to enter a plea of not guilty by reason of insanity. The Victoria Advocate reports a judge agreed Monday with a defense request to shackle Harris for the safety of everyone in the court. Investigators have said DNA samples link the 54-year-old Harris to six assaults or attempted assaults over the past two years involving women 65 to 91 years old. Harris was arrested January 8th in Edina, about 100 miles southwest of Houston. The second week of the Texas Congressional Redistricting Trial began Monday. Republicans say the map is fair and maintains or increases the voting power of minorities. Democrats contend that the Republican-drawn map splits Hispanic and black communities and favors conservative white voters in congressional elections. Congressman Henry Culler is among several Texas Democrat representatives expected at the federal trial. This is Gene Key, SkyServe News.